And anyone wanting to do a little tropical garden, these beautiful bromeliads are such a beautiful pop of colour. Um, we did put these in with the haliconias. Uh, just because the haliconias, um, until they flower, um, are just quite green. So we wanted to add a pop of colour. So we've got a little flower coming up in the middle there. Um, but they're just fantastic and they've been popping up because there's so much water in this little retaining wall um, that they've got no issue um, holding all the moisture there and continuing to grow. Um, but they're an awesome little plant um, just to, yeah, just to have a pop of colour um, in your tropical garden. So there's our xanadus. Xanadus always do well. Um, this one on this side is doing a lot better because we do plant it, um, we do water it quite a fair bit, um, but it does grow and it does have long roots. So this is a traveling root here, um, which you've got to be careful of. Um, they're very, very thick roots um, and they will travel to find water, water source. So that's one thing you've just got to be wary of um, when you're planting your xanadus. And we've also got our beautiful flame flame plant um, this is actually growing quite tall it's about a meter tall now um, but once again it just gives a pop of color just gives a pop of color there um, but we love our tropical garden and i just wanted to show you what it's like in the cooler months um, to then show you the progress for the summer months